Well, welcome back to our video course on Microsoft Word 2010. In this video, I want to show you the document formatting properties. Now, all the document formatting properties you can get to by coming to the Page Layout tab in the ribbon up at the top. And you'll see your Page Setup options are right here. If you prefer to work in the Page Setup dialog box, you can also click this icon right here, and the Page Setup dialog box will appear. But right from here, you can go ahead and set your margins to some typical margins. You can change the page orientation to portrait or landscape. You can set the size of the paper. And you can also set up document columns. We won't be dealing with document columns or breaks in this video, but you can look for um, other videos on those particular topics. And most of these options actually have a more option down at the bottom of them. You'll see that with both margins and with size. When I click on that, it basically opens up this page setup dialog box. And here again, you can set up the margins top, bottom, left, and right. You can set a gutter if you're working with columns and a gutter position. You can also go ahead and change the orientation from right here. And you can choose how multiple pages are laid out, either with mirrored margins as a booklet, or two pages per sheet, or with a regular book fold. You also have some tabs up here at the top. The paper tab will allow you to change the size paper and the source for the printer. And there are also some presets here for you. We also have layout, which will determine some things about section formatting, as well as the header and the footer information. And we'll look at the header and the footer information as well as section formatting again in another video. Once you've made whatever changes you want in um, this dialog box, you can simply click OK and the changes will take effect. So those are some of your document formatting options inside of Microsoft Word 2010.